Hello there, and welcome back to the Oil of Mull. Today, we're stopping here. Uh, this is Debranach, Debrana, and we're actually stopping in the end part, which is the Otter Holt at Debrana. Debrana means bouncing hares, bouncing otters, hence I think the name Otter Holt, bouncing otters, it all ties in. Beautiful place. Uh, we're in Salem, and lovely quiet little road this i mean i can stand in the middle of the road there is nothing coming there's nothing about beautiful absolutely beautiful you can hear the main road in the back very faintly so it's really quiet and peaceful um yeah join me in a minute and we'll go and have a little walk around and i'll show you around the otter Holt, which is a self-catering annex um absolutely beautiful in here i have stopped here before and Lena Steve who run it um, lovely couple lovely couple really friendly so if ever you stop here and you need anything at all even if you want things to go and do on the island and see fantastic they will help you They'll, they've got all they've got so much knowledge about mull um, yeah beautiful place you anyway, know jump in a minute and we'll go and pop up and have a look at the annex so, first thing you see is a little honesty box with the eggs. Sorry, closed today, so no eggs today. Uh, we have a little sign. Just look at the house. I tell you what, it's an impressive house. This is absolutely beautiful. I think they're going to open up as um, B and B as well, but for the moment, it is just the annex on the side. I'll just show you this. The Branner with the little otters. How cool is that? beautiful so yep yeah, I wanted before we go in there what we have next door is a takeaway um, the taste of mull so if you come here and it's a bit late and you just you know you want something quick to eat literally Tim and Diane who run the takeaway they've got um, lodges next door heart of mull self catering lodges and if I just walk down the road a bit not the bins just here, but the next bit, which is literally 20 yards away, is where the takeaway is. They do fantastic cake, coffee, fish and chips, burgers. There's outside seating area. Um, they have a fire pit to keep you warm if it's a little bit cool. There's plenty parking here, as you can see. I think the guests just park outside the front of the, uh, the window here. It's uh, absolutely lovely. The weather's a bit uh, gloomy today. I'm hoping it's going to pick up later in the week. What we do get, the fields over the back here, are full of deer. And on a the morning, they'll run through, and you can actually get deer on the front grass. So you can look out the windows, and you can watch a deer. Um, just turn you around. Here's the Otter Holt. As you can see, just lead up into the steps. Let's go and have a look inside. My shoes off. So, first thing we have, we have fridge, washing machine, we have cooker, we have kitchen space, kettle, cupboards, microwave, we have a dining table, we have seating, TV. Look at these. Oh, these must be local artists. Stan Brown. Little Island Cows. Oh, I'll show you this one on the uh, stairs in a minute. Little look around again. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. I'll take you upstairs and uh, we can have a look up there. There's a few little bits of uh, information about Mull. A couple of uh, photography magazines. I know Steve is into his photography and Lynn. Um, so if you're into photography, have a word with them and they'll help you out with locations and anything else. I've got to just show you this. How cool is this? What a fantastic little picture. Looks like oil painting. Love it. Beautiful. I'll just turn you around as we go up the stairs now. Yeah, here's a quick little look back in the downstairs so now let's go and have a look upstairs 
and here we have the bedroom I'll stand here so we can have a look around window looking out the back another big island cow above the bed double sized bed beautiful what I have noticed in here before is there are sockets everywhere which is a fantastic thing for me because I have so many things to charge up with all my camera gear when I come here there's a socket down there, there's sockets there, there's sockets there there's another socket down by the window down here so you're not sure of any charging at all I'll show you out the window this is the view you get we do face full north here and it's a fantastic place to get northern lights the aurora on a clear night um, you can just see the, the sky just lights up green because we're in a dark zone as well the um, fantastic for stars you get the milky way looking south brilliant during the summer months when the um, sunset is like half past ten if you're a bit tired you can actually watch the sunset from the bed and all the colours leave the curtains open it's fantastic you've got a uh, little wardrobe there little chair mirror howdy show the bathroom put the light up little ensuite we have a sink mirror we have shower we have toilet towel rail beautiful as I say I have stopped here before and it is just a beautiful little annex this um, Jump in a second, back downstairs. So, back downstairs, again, there are sockets all round. The, it, the sockets for me are a big thing, being a photographer, because I have so much to um, charge up every, every night when I come back. There's microphones, there's my GoPro, my cameras, everything, the drone. So, having a lot of sockets really is a big thing for me. We have Wi Fi. Um, yeah, I'm going to pop outside and just show you around outside a little bit more. I love it in here. So when I stopped here a couple of weeks back, about a month ago, loved it, loved every minute, it was fantastic. Show me back outside. So, just have a little look outside now, just show you around. The, there's parking next door for the lodges next door. They're set into the trees, so you get no noise from them at all. Um, I don't think, there is cars going past on the main road, they've probably just had a ferry come in. Um, but I don't think you'll pick it up on the GoPro, I can barely hear it here. Beautiful place, parking is just outside the, the window here. Um, there are walks everywhere, there's a great walk if you've got a dog, if you bring a dog here, we are, they are dog friendly, pet friendly. Um, if you walk down the street, you can follow the road down a bit, you can cross over up the hill, then you can just see the forest at the top of the hill up there. It's a gentle climb, it's just a gentle little walk, takes about an hour and a half. Fantastic walk for the dogs, uh, brilliant. Just over the back that way, you've got the old pier, you've got the boats in Salem. Um, there's a spa, there's a cafe in Salem as well, they've got the coffee box. In Salon at the coffee box is also an honesty box at the back where they sell cake. Uh, the cake is absolutely fantastic, very rich and no doubt very fattening. Um, it is really nice and you can just pop in there at midnight if you get peckish and get it. Yeah, I'll put a link to the Otter Holt at De Branna on down in the description below. Um, they're on Facebook, uh, the Otter Holt at to Branner. Um I will just show the sign here. Oh yeah, you're right. You alright mate? Just so you can spell De Branna. D O B H R A N A C H De Brannock pronounced De Ban De Branna. Bounding otters. Little otters with it as well. Beautiful little touches, beautiful little touches. So yep. Yeah, Check the links out below in the description. Um, drop a comment on the video if you fancy stopping there. Uh, Lynn and Steve, fantastic hosts, I've got to say. Um, very knowledgeable. Love photography, the both of them. 
Um, if you need to know anything about eagles, otters, the other wildlife on the island, you've got seals, you've got deer. There is just so much on mull, as you, you probably already know. But yeah, drop me a comment, your thoughts on the Isle of Mull. If you come here, drop me a comment and I can pass the details on for you or use the links below to contact Lynn and Steve direct or through Airbnb. And yeah, enjoy your stay on Mull if you come to the Isle of Mull. It is a fantastic island and I guarantee once you've been, you'll want to come back time and time again. It really is fantastic here. Yeah? So thanks for watching and check it out. Until next time, I'll put a couple of photos on that I've got from different places on the island. Something for you to see. There's the boats, there's the pier, there's, oh, there's beaches, the white beaches. It's just fantastic. Until next time, take it easy. Enjoy these couple of photos and I'll catch you soon.